But whether you stream games or live music, viewers will not stick around if your audio is out of balance. And how many times have you been on a stream when the music's been too loud, the game's been too loud, and you can't hear what the person's saying? Now the good news is you can fix this, it's easy, and I'm going to show you how in under three minutes. Okay, so to get our music and our game to drop down when, uh, when you speak, we'll go ahead and right click first on music and choose filters. We need to add up the OBS compressor. This again is just a built-in item. Call it compressor, there we go. Now the ratio is how much it's going to reduce the music as I speak, so I'm going to set that at about 7 to 1. Threshold I'm going to set it around minus 32, and that's just how loud I have to be before it reduces the music. Tack's going to sit right around 200, and the idea is that sounds natural. It's going to uh, reduce the music within 200 milliseconds. Release is going to sit right around 850 milliseconds. The idea there is that that's uh, when it's going to let the music get back up to normal volume. Finally, I have to change this to ducking and choose my microphone. So whatever your microphone is, make sure it's there. That's it for music. We're going to do the same thing for game here. Filters. Go ahead and choose OBS uh, compressor. And here I'm going to leave the ratio at about 10 to 1. I like the game audio to get a little quieter when I'm speaking than the music, just because it interferes a little more. Once again, the threshold should be the same as the, as the music, so around minus 32 here. Attack, same thing, about 200 milliseconds to be the same as what I did for music. And release again here is going to be about 850, just again to keep that natural as the game audio comes back up in volume. Once again, we'll choose the microphone, and we're good to go. Now we have game and music going to be reduced when I speak. And so here we are in the game. As I'm talking, you hear the music and game audio drop down. Now I'll be silent. And you see it's really natural. It drops down a little more quickly and comes back a little more slowly. And if you really want to take control of your stream in OBS Studio, and who doesn't? I made these videos showing you how to separate out your audio sources and take full control with the Stream Deck.